Joining me now for our Friday panel is Francis Awusu, the founder of Culture Break, and Anna Finizio from Hilmer's Network. So great to see you both. Good to see you too, Erin. Hello, Erin. Lovely to be with you and Francis tonight. No, thank you so much. Now, the Prime Minister is resetting his campaign for an Indigenous voice to Parliament, promising more detail and a bipartisan committee to garner more support. Francis, I want to start with you. You started Culture Break because you wanted this country to be more inclusive after you experienced racism as a child. I want to know what you think of this concept of the voice. Yeah, having lived with, uh, with uh, effects of racism, I know all too well what it's like to feel um, ignored and not have a voice. So I think having a voice is better than, than not, but whether it actually makes a difference will be remains to be seen. I mean, let's face it, um, not all Australians feel now that their voice has been heard by their political representatives. So whether this, will, this voice department will be anything different, well, remains to be seen. And are on the political side of things, the Prime Minister is conceding more and more on this issue. He's obviously desperate to secure federal Liberal support. Does it look weak, do you think, from his perspective, like he's panicking a little bit? Or do you think it's more the fact that he said at the start, I'm going to work with the opposition? Look, Aaron, whatever it is, finally we've got some commitment to detail. We haven't seen any of that detail yet, of course, but I think it's only going to be helpful to the Australian people to have some detail around what they're actually voting for when it comes to the voice. And I think it'll be a positive thing for the Yes campaign too. So it's about time and it's a reasonable request to see the detail around the voice. Francis, without notice, how do you think you'll vote? Well, I think it's a good starting point. I think I'd, I'll probably vote yes, um, because I think it's a good starting point. But as I said, it's a starting point. I think there, there are more you know, pressing issues in our community that we need to address that will need to couple not just a voice to parliament, but really make real change for all Australians, including Indigenous ones.